and I stole it. It's fine. Uh, 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 hello, Mimi. How are you doing? Puzzling out YouTube settings. I am. Why? Well, YouTube is so stupid sometimes. I, um, I actually bumped into a problem last night. So, um, as you all know, I've been working very hard to um, process all of my previous streams and break them up into chunks. And um, and so, you know, for the for the sake of republishing them on YouTube, so that people can like watch just the content they want and not have to watch the whole stream, you know. So I've been doing that, and uh, it's been a lot of work. I won't lie. I, I I would love to tell you honestly how much work was involved there, but it would be so tedious. No one would. No one wants that. No one wants to hear how hard your work is, Pimple. Um, like this is probably. I you know honestly someone out there and i'm gonna say this is fair it's like wow you know you work exactly one day and you think you've got it hard I'm like yeah you're not wrong <clears throat> but um whoops that was not what i wanted to do i wanted to pause um but yeah it's been hard please god people i need help i got sucked into a jrpg it's called like a dragon Look at it. Is it on? No. Oh, well, I, I, knowing it's knowing Kevbo, it's probably not on Steam. Like a. Oh, Yakuza. Are you talking about Yakuza? I uh. So. <laughs> uh, Kevbo, I was very tempted to buy that specifically with the intention of streaming it. Um, but I have a hard no de nuvo stance. If a game has de nuvo on it, I just pass on it like hard pass and um it's a really it's a really annoying to me that uh, a game like it's, it's very strange to me that some games will just include de nuvo if you don't know what de nuvo is it's it's basically um anti-piracy kind of like copy protection and it's one of the more intrusive kinds um and in fact intrusive in the sense that it'll actually affect the performance of the game and every single time I see a game that has De Nuvo on it, I look at the reviews and undoubtedly every single time there are people saying, yeah, there's like really weird stutters on this game and I have a really good computer. There's no reason there should be stutters here. I know we're getting into it with a spicy topic, but um, the point is, is I was going to buy Like a Dragon because it was actually a really good price um, for the uh, winter sale. And, and then I saw that it had De Nuvo. And here's the crazy part. Um, there is a recently a re, um, oh, well, how do I put this? Scott Pilgrim vs. The World was a game, um, originally on the PS3, and it was a really good game. If you've never played it, it's a beat-em-up with, uh, the Scott Pilgrim story and characters. Really, really well d designed. Great, great gameplay, great music, great, um, visual design. Love that game played the heck out of it it's honestly on uh, for me it's on the same level as castle crashers anyway it was unavailable to play on pc for years this game came out in like 2007 i want to say it's like it's old it's like 2007 or 2010 you know like it's 10 years old right and it finally came out on PC and it came out exclusive to Epic. I'm not gonna talk about that necessarily. If you wanna take the Epic cut, that's fine, whatever. But the problem is, is it was exclusive to Epic for like another year. So it's like, okay, fine. Your, your game is like 10 years old and you're gonna take the Epic cut at the last second, sure. Right? So now it's no longer exclusive to Epic. It comes out on Steam as well. Um, and it has the Nuvo on it. And it doesn't just have De Nuvo on it. It's got Ubisoft's stupid launcher on it as well. Ubi Connect or some garbage. And I'm just like, why? My dude, why are you making it impossible for me to want to buy your game? And it's $4. Canadian, it's probably like a buck 50 for everyone else. Why are you putting this like highly invasive copy protection on your $2 game. 
I would have bought it. I would have bought it. And you know, the crazy thing is, this game is so old now, it's not just piratable. It's actually emulatable. Like you can emulate the PS3 now. So you can emulate Scott Pilgrim versus the world. So why, why are we doing this? And there's other games too that do this, like uh, uh, Persona 2, another game I would have bought. It's usually Sega. Sega just loves putting Denuvo on it, like everything. But this time it was Ubisoft as well. But like Persona 2, a PSP game, my dog, we can, we can emulate the actual shit out of that game. Why are we, why are we putting Denuvo on our ancient ass 12 year old game? It's ridiculous and over the top and anime stupid, but it's also touching and earnest and hilarious. Plus the RPG combat is great. No idea how it is for streaming, but it's fun. Well, I really want to stream uh, a Yakuza game at some point because it's rife. It's rife for cool voices. There's a lot of dialogue in those Yakuza games and the dialogue is known for being very good. And I have a couple of Yakuza games and uh, I, I would love to play them. Wish everything goes well for you, Bimple, and I think your struggles are hard work, and hard work is valid. I appreciate that, Mimi. I mean, even if you're wrong, but, you know, <laughs> you know I, I, I do appreciate that. I hate the Nuvo as a Linux user account. I, I really enjoyed losing my Smite account due to an automatic ban because I was using unrecognized drivers. All I know is my partner is super gay, literally, and so am I. I uh, Kevbo outing himself in, uh, in chat. I don't know, herself. I never really came, came to think of it. For Yakuza and made me watch the Yakuza series and prayed on my weakness for RPGs and I, I definitely want to do the Yakuza series at some point. I, I'd be willing to, to play through it. Anyway, um, I've been in chatty mode for a bit. I want to I want to get get into War War Tales. I want to I want to do a War Tale or so. Um, if you haven't been following along, let me update you on the uh, goings ons on in War Tales. Uh, I've been struggling. I won't lie. I've been struggling a lot. Um, I, I'm like broke. Everyone's injured. I can't afford to uh, heal them. Um, th some people are diseased. In fact, a lot of people are diseased. And in fact, this is an old save. I forgot about it. I had to uh, unfortunately kill a save because it was like a dark end. Outed myself. Yo, congratulations, Kevbo. That's that's pretty gay, but honestly, good good for you. Listen, I, I, I please recognize the extra layer of irony in my statement. Um, it's it's you know I just <laughs> have to uh, throw that out there. Um, what is happening? Oh, I guess I'm in pause mode. Uh, so I gotta I don't know sell some stuff. I forget. Oh, maybe uh, I, I have food. I think what happened last time is I went over here and completed this quest. So we're gonna go ahead and do, go ahead and do that. I don't know why I'm trying to use WASD for this game. Anyway, thanks for um, tolerating my rant about. Oh, we don't need those. About uh, De Nuvo. It really is um, frustrating. Um, oh yeah, uh, stupid fog. Let's, uh, let's go through the forest over here. Grab some mushrooms. Hard to get gayer than sodomy. I don't know. Is there... Is there... How, 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 how gay can it get? Oh, right. I have to go in the forest over there. I see you. I don't understand, like it, it, sometimes it doesn't recognize it. Um, guys, today, I, I, oh, so let me, sorry, let me back up a second. I, I've been really enjoying, what is happening? I've been really enjoying um, War Tales and I've been probably playing, like I've been shortchanging the second segment. I actually am starting to get into uh, while, uh, Weird West. And so I do want to, um, like, do that, play that game properly. Um, so I'm probably not going to do, like, a three-hour 
or tails segment today just so you know but that being said if things get you know no no promises on that regard i, I who can say like things things might get really interesting and i might want to continue um nevelina wong is gonna jump over here and we're gonna smack this champion as quickly as possible annihilate them ignores guard i guess uh, I, I thought that guard was like their armor but i guess i was wrong about that weaken them who's next in the turn order okay so you're probably oh good it's a hammer bro hammer bros are great because they take two turns to attack so basically they never get to land their stuff is reading all my shadow ban comments hey uh, good news chat well i say good news but i, I really shouldn't say this i'm gonna say it because i'm gonna trust you which isn't a good idea <laughs> chat chat i'm breaking out the i'm talking to you emote here because this is important okay i got rid of shadow banning it's gone it's gone i found i found the option for um basically approve comments to go through on live chat and since it um it most of the time it seems to not work i turned it off so i need you all to to work with me here um <laughs> we're gonna work together yeah there you go i so the first thing we're gonna do is not <laughs> spam the chat with emotes listen okay you get you get a like a five minute grace period i know y'all been you've been hankering to throw some emotes in chat um so you know fair enough go ahead but uh you know all i have to all I, I, like i just when you say something in chat i i really want to like try it and we're gonna form a habit okay chat we're gonna form a habit and you know you know who you are you know who like you know if i'm talking to you specifically <laughs> like all i want you to do is remember when you say something in chat if it might put someone off reading it that is completely new to my stream that's it um you know like this includes like um maybe maybe minor argumentative stuff you know like uh includes like you know, oh, you're wrong for liking X, Y, and Z game. Um, and, you know, some politics, I know we get political around here, and I like to get political as well. So, I mean, you know, uh, there's it's a gray area, but uh, I, I need us all to work together to form, uh, form Voltron, um, the Voltron of chats. You know, a chat that is welcoming and... A, you know feels like a warm fireplace of chats like the the coziest chat possible so we can you know we we get all the memes in the world uh and we don't you know we don't alienate uh the new you know any any anyone with uh any you know problems i don't know like listen i don't know hey wait a minute mimi just got a temporary valor point was there an update I was saying last time that she should get valor points for that because she she attacks multiple people but she wasn't getting them she gets them now what's up yo what's up did the game get updated yo did i change the game baba booey baba booey what is that second part kevbo i know the baba booey but what is that second part in game chat is still moderated though so that's good if you say something in chat and it might put someone off reading it, that's completely new to my stream. You know who you are, Kevbo. Just call out my... No, it's not just you, Kevbo. There's more than one. <laughs> but it is you, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, you know. Y you know I love you. Yeah, like, you, you know I do. Um, but yeah. And so, you know, I'm not, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna mince words, but... You know, we're, we're working together to create some kind of community. I mean, the community is apparently, uh, according to some, why P 
people even show up in my chat you know wild i know it's crazy um but yeah like that's that's the thing so you know i, I just want to like you know i want to i want to uh harbor that oh my god what the heck granoff i didn't even see you over there granoff granoff second part is another thing howard stern fans would scream when prank calling he called me out <laughs> Listen, we've we've had our differences for sure, but I think for the most part, you know, we're we're on good terms, and I think that, uh, you know, I I don't like I I I'm for the usually, I'll say usually because I I'm not I, I don't have a perfect track record. I'm good with disagreeing with people. Um, the only time I'd say I was like truly uh, snarky was with the NFT guy, but I thought I just had the high ground on that. Apparently not. <laughs> I think, you know, I think that's a, on a completely different note. This is, this is a, a completely different note now, though. I, I honestly worry about if I have the charisma to carry a stream and or YouTube, YouTube channel, if I can't even snark on an NFT without chat turning on me. Because, like, I was snarking on that NFT guy pretty hard. And chat was, chat was not having it. Like, well... I mean, come on, let's just agree to disagree. I'm like, come, it's NFTs though, dude. Like, oh, you know, not to get spicy, but are we gonna, uh, harb, you know, like, are, are we gonna middle ground a uh, Holocaust denier next? Come on. Come on, bro. When's the last time you bought a, a graphics card, you know? Like, this, is, this stuff has ruined, ruined the last, like, it ruined the whole pandemic. NFTs ruined the whole pandemic. We were going to have a nice little cozy pandemic. And I couldn't buy a graphics card because of this garbage. <laughs> that one might actually get me in trouble. Might might actually uh that might that might be a bit too spicy. I'm a piece of human garbage, but I try not to ruin Bimple stream. Well, I appreciate that. I mean, I'm not Agreeing with that first part, just for the record. The NFT got down to the details. What you call NFTs is not necessarily what other people understand the term as. What does that mean? You mean like... So... Oh, uh, you know what? I don't think there's any anything good that can come of, of this conversation. Especially if if I still don't have the moral high ground. Um, I mean, I guess, but like, I don't agree with any uh, concept of NFTs. Like, I don't, I don't think there's any good version of that. You know, like, I I firmly do believe that there's a good and a bad way to execute just about every concept. You know, like, okay, let's you know just to get into it for a second, um, like loot crates for example okay so like loot boxes um hats in games i mean we're, we're talking about digital ownership but really it's not the same thing as nfts but the fact of the matter is i think that there are good ways to like for instance have like monetization in a free-to-play game there are there there are like ethical ways of doing that they're not common they're not commonly done because people have come to find that the abusive ways of monetizing a game are uh, the best ways. They're gonna they're gonna you know create the the most amount of FOMO, and they're just gonna you know get the most people to to buy money or buy money to to spend money that wouldn't have initially, right? So like I do think that there are good and bad ways to execute an idea. But I don't think there's really, I literally do not think that there's any good way to execute an NFT. That's my stance. I mean, you, you are welcome to disagree with me, and that's fine. But, you know, like this, I'm, I'm not going to draw too many lines in the sand and say I think you're just wrong. But this is one of those times. Um, the only other time is if you think that the J.J. Abrams Star Trek universe was good. That's it. Those two things. Give, chat, give me those two things. And 
and then we're good, okay? You can have everything else, right? You can uh, dunk on me for liking Waterworld. Um, you can you can dunk on me for uh, what else? Um, for being bad at video games. Uh, you can dunk on me for being a, like a mediocre streamer. Just those those two things. Well, everything else is is on the table. You didn't see me. I made a bunch of hand motions there that I just realized no one's no one sees because I'm I'm just a PNG. The prequels are actually okay. Well, I wasn't gonna die on that hill, Neville, but I do agree. <laughs> um, the, that's a that's an opinion I keep to myself because there's no winning that. Uh, I've talked about this before on my stream, but I do think that there is like. There are certain topics that, um, I don't know how to put it. There's like a social weight to them. Like you are correct for not liking this. You are incorrect for liking this. And more often than not, um, your people are just correct for hating on the, on the prequels and that, whatever, like, you know, whatever brings people together, I suppose. This is a tricky situation because I can't run past this guy. Um, who's next to attack this person? Okay, so I do get two different turns. I should be able to kill this guy without uh, without him getting his attack off. Oh, you know what? We want to shift over just slightly because I want uh, Cactus to get in there as well. Oh, can we just kill him? I'm using all, all amounts of Valor. I'm using, like, all of my Valor. Uh... The prequels are actually okay. Oh no. <laughs> we were gonna have a nice cozy little pandemic little mayo. <laughs> NFT thing got the detailed yeah yeah. Um I'm a little bit worried about Granoff over here. Oh, you're targeting now, huh? Well, it's too bad you're dead. Hmm. Actually, can I have a third thing? I also hate Tim Hortons. Okay, we're done. Wow, I, I, I straight up cannot get over there. Damn. Damn. It's because there's mud. There's like a slight debuff. Ouch. Oh my god, Granoff? Granoff might eat the big burrito here. Well, never mind. He's he's going to be an absolute G. Your opponents are demoralized and flee. Do you want to let them go? No. We're going to use our last little bit of valor here. Try and kill this lad. Actually, shoot. If I had engaged with him first, I would have got that Valor for free. And now I, I've wasted my hard Valor in, in exchange for soft Valor. Shoot. Mimi Smash. Um, how is chat doing? How was your Wednesday? My Wednesday was pretty good. Um, thanks for asking. Uh... <laughs> I finished a, a week-long process of processing all my videos. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, YouTube, um, YouTube's really dumb. They they stopped me from like uh, uploading video, like not videos per se, but like thumbnails. They were they they actually literally stopped me from processing my videos because they were like, you've done enough. No, no, no. As soon as I tried to upload like a new custom thumbnail for like my 120th video, they were like, nah, bro, um, you're done. You gotta wait like at least 24 hours. I was like, what? What do you mean? Oh, critical. I like the little sword slash wipe of the blood at the end there. Ooh, we got a new hammer. I think it's the same hammer, actually. Okay, 
completed a mission report to an emissary to claim your reward let's do that um yeah so i finished i like i you know i waited until like one in the morning and then i <clears throat> finished it i really just wanted to finish that off like i was so sick and tired of the this like for real i i was so exhausted with this task um it's it's gonna be a lot easier for me now in the future um so that's nice um and yeah processing videos now that like i've learned i learned a lot i had to learn basically two new programs in order to process my streams um so we brought in that quest is there another quest we can take a rat infestation oh god i don't like the rat infestations that's how i got diseased in the first place this is not enough money to even cover the freaking medic medicine i need to to recover from this stupid mission i injured my finger and now i have to try to write code without being able to feel the keyboard with my pinky oh that sucks oh i'm sorry that's awful um yeah that that's brutal surprisingly hard <laughs> yeah i bet uh the day is almost over let's uh do like a rest let's rest yeah it's gonna cost we recover some valor and it's gonna uh recuperate and recover uh i wish this would help get rid of disease like i, I kind of wish they could, we could get rid of disease Mm, I don't know if that's even worth it. I think I'd rather spend some of that money on some um, medicine. I had a minor injury to the pointy finger. Pointer finger? You mean the index finger? On my main hand, thanks to a patient. There's a... Yeah, I mean, I have uh, I have questions now. It costs 155. I could buy five medicine. Didn't I buy something before? Wasn't there a good reason I shouldn't do this? Not very subtle. Uh, let's uh, compare this hammer with Mimi's hammer. So this is the same hammer. Renegade's two-handed hammer. It's exactly the same hammer. Okay. Well, that's good. Because that means I can sell it. Um... Surely be of interest to scientists in Alazar. Infected brain. I don't know if I should keep that or not. All right, I'm going to buy all of that medicine. Uh, where did it go? Oh, wait, that was medicine and not the... Oh, shoot. I bought the wrong thing. Oh, my God. Okay, let me see if I can make some money back. This is awful. I still need to find a tracker to sell my fangs to. I have so many fangs and I can't sell any of them. That was so stupid. I just, uh, I just bought a bunch of medicine. Reduces suspicion gains during a theft. Uh, you know what? Let's sell this bar of soap. When you blow into it, the instrument mimics the call of a duck. Me too. The fingers tend to heal quickly, though, so I'm not too worried in the long run. Sorry the YouTube gave you a hard time. It's it's fine. Um, it's just like, I, I was honestly, like, after, like, painfully struggling with this business for, like, uh, a week, I was very much done with the whole thing. And I was like, you, you, like, I could have been finished. And instead, I'm like, I have to, I have to spend more time with it. So uh, that was really my only grief. We need snow iris. I have to go and get some snow iris. Then I can make medicine. Um, I'd like to be able to make a cure for this uh, disease. Uh, um, everyone is diseased. And it sucks. And also, it limits us to being able to eat meat. And may go mad if they become famished. I guess it's not a big deal. I don't know if it actually has a statistical difference. 
Um, let's see if the market has any fish. I don't know why I'm looking here. You don't have fish. You're not Patrick. Perch. Uh, we don't have any wisdom points. Do we know how to cook perch? Carp and pike. Oh, perch broth right there. Um, dang, I wish I could make some perch broth. That would have been excellent. Maybe we can make some stuff uh, at the blacksmith. Didn't I make some stuff and then sell it? Also, doesn't, um, isn't it Granoff needs a, a better sword or something? Iron, no, I, I guess I already made him the Elf Bert so, uh, sword, so that's good. Um, can we make anything else right now? Uh, we can make some throwing knives. We can only make one throwing knife. If I was to buy some leather, we could make some more stuff. If I was to make an iron axe, I would get some, uh, knowledge, but I don't have enough wood. Um, all right, well, I do want to, I need to get some knowledge, and if I can get some knowledge, then maybe we can learn how to make perch. I don't think I actually have any perch. Oh, yeah, I do have perch. That's kind of why I want to do this in the first place. Sweet schizophrenia and withdrawals. What? Sure, I do not want to know what the patient did. Oh, my God. So where do we want to go? I've got this bandit's lair over here, which, which is difficulty hard. Go to the border crossing to meet with your client. There's a mission over here to bring a message to Cor um, Corsia. There's a mission over here. Someone needs help in the abandoned tower. At least that's what he's screaming out the window. I'm pretty sure I tried to go over here and I did not succeed. So... Yeah. Um, there's a road over here. I think that's where I was going in the first place. Let's go to this border crossing. And I'm going to save. Uh, I have been, I have been um, kind of saving more often in this game. Uh, I don't know. Sick. Why did it, did it, it didn't ask me for a name last time. Might be better to save up at least two times wages before you spend any more. Yeah, you're you're not wrong. I need to complete a couple of quests, uh, and I really need to cure everyone. Oh, I remember. I went to the tower last time, um, and that's when we got Imatan. Imatan uh, was was received in a uh, in that attempted quest, and then I died. So we can't cook anything right now, correct? We don't have any wheat, we don't have any carp, and we don't have any per uh, pike. We can't cook pork. Imagine not being able to cook pork. All I'm saying is, uh, yeah, that's pretty brutal. Is there a food limit? Must consume meat or... Oh, I see. Is that like how much meat we have to consume? And now we can I can throw some other things on there. Okay, that's an interesting way of doing things. Are you kidding me? Where negotiate requires thirty three money, two henchmen, two raider, and a bomber. <sighs> okay. Well, I guess we're gonna fight them. I always feel sorry for the pigs I'm eating. Um, I definitely want to take out the bomber first. Raider bomber. They are in the center, like, um, very, they're going to be surrounded by everyone. So they're going to be very hard to get a hold of. Imagine not being able to cook pork. Wow, Bimple is, <laughs> Jesus Christ. 
Um. Yeah, not not what I meant at all. Where is okay, poor Lay? You're gonna be over there. Granoff is gonna go and engage with this guy and get us a valor. I'm gonna engage with Nevelina. We're gonna engage, engage from behind, which is not a great idea, but I'm, I'm hoping to kill this guy pretty quickly. Oh, except this guy. We don't get the points from Nevelina. I thought we got an honor for that. It's okay. This guy is gonna engage with uh, Granoff. Maybe it's only Granoff and Cactus. Do we get? Okay, we get a valor from that. Wow, Granoff already lost his armor. So now I want to move over with um, Parlay, and we're gonna get a nice, cool backstab. And also, can we? Uh, that's not gonna work. Okay, never mind. We'll get another Valor. A little bit worried about uh, Nevelina. I'm hoping... Okay, he's... Yeah, he's he got hit in the back. So if I move over here... And I... Can I do a... Yes, that's what we want. And we're going to get a, a Valor for that. And then I'm going to go ahead and do something like this... We'll see if this amounts to anything. Um, Granoff, what are you going to do? Let's do an extra fun kick on this guy. Destabilize him. Give a nice, an extra, extra punch. Yeah, I figured this, this guy was going to run off. Yeah, I'm a little bit worried about this guy. Because, yeah, he's one of these dudes that sets people on fire, unfortunately. And, unfortunately, Cactus is in the mud over here. And he's on fire. Interesting uh, tactic. When are, Okay, they're at the end of the turn order, so that's fine. Um, what I'd like to do... Ah, I have a good idea. Can Porlay... Oh, we're not at the end of the turn order, actually. We're not at the new t turn order, I should say. Who... Okay, so it's it's Reno. Reno is... Uh, he's up. So let's go... Let's go over here. I want to put him in the middle so he can might... He might actually be able to, like, help someone. And I really need to hit this guy as much as possible. There we go. So who's next? Oh, Hammer Bro? That's fine. So what I want to do actually... Oh, she can't... So Mimi can't actually like get out of this stance. Is this even going to hit the Raider? I don't think it is. Um, What I'm going to do is I'm going to move over here. And kind of block this bomber, but I'm gonna hit this guy. Nice. And then we're gonna end the turn. Get some valor. Pimple immediately invokes. Jesus Christ. I rest my case. Now, now remember, remember, we're trying to we're trying to create a nice a uh, nice chat. Oh, why did I do that? That was silly. I can kill this guy. I'll get some free valor. I need to. I need to kill this bomber as soon as possible. Um, and you know what? He can heal himself. So why? Why isn't that? I guess he can only heal an adjacent ally. Okay, cool. So he can't heal himself for the fire. Very good. That sucks. Honestly. What the heck? He just set everyone on fire. Being adjacent to someone on fire puts you on fire. <laughs> this is news to me. It's too bad I don't have an extra Valor. I could probably kill this guy. Raider got one foot in and one foot out. Like a dunce. Like a dance. Granos actually gonna 
kind of eat it here if we don't deal with this henchman, and I'm not going to be able to. Who's next? This raider over here. Uh, raid this raider is actually going to do some really nice damage, and I hate that for him. Oh my god, he almost killed Adreno. Um, how come, how come Mimesis can't move? She's gonna kill Drino right now. No! Oh my god. So, that's not good. Mimi just smacked Drino and he I, he, I don't think he's dying yet, but very soon. In fact, he's on fire. Why do these combats seem to be going, like, so badly lately? Like, I, I can't seem to recover from anything right now. It's it's really bad. This fire shtick is really getting old very quickly, especially since I can't seem to recover from it at all. The fact that um, Drino can't heal himself is really infuriating. When an enemy has less than half of their health, they use chains or rope to capture them. Oh, okay. Let's do that. Mimi Smash? Yeah, I mean, I guess Mimi Smash. Oh, I don't want to go... I guess he's already on fire. I want to go over here and kill this guy. Oh. Can only use one base. Oh, okay, never mind. Well, at least we get some valor. Granoff might die. It's not. It's not going. Mimi accidentally smack. I need to kill this guy, please. There we go. Get him out of there. Um, this, this raider is going next. Yeah, we're about to die. Drino is dead. Drino is dying. Dying you can only move. If you heal them before they take damage, they will be able to fight again. If not, they will be permanently lost. We might be losing Drino. If I'm playing with any Iron Man, like, options at all... So this attack is not going off for agreed, right? The fact that Drino can't patch himself up really sucks. I don't think anyone else has that ability. I don't think anyone else has that ability to like patch him up. So it's just Drino. Um, yeah, I mean, Drino's dead for sure. We lost Drino. Glorious. Apparently we got some uh, valor for that. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, it's not going well. What can I say? I should have just given them the money, huh? Honestly, one less mouth to feed. Uh, not a terrible idea right now. Rip Reno. Well, uh, if I'm going with the uh, Imatan suggestion of like, as long as uh, Mimesis is alive, we continue, then uh, then we continue. At least I can, at least it, when a unit is on fire, I can also set the enemy on fire. But we also take five damage per turn. Are we alive? I mean, barely. That was awful. We lost uh, Drino. Who, was Drino our cook? No, uh, Granoff is our cook. 
What was Drino? Was he our apothecarist? I wish this would stop flickering. What do you mean? Oh, uh, Berthlin is our captor. So honestly, I might, you know what we could do is turn around and uh, head towards the, the, um, the prison. One less mouth to feed. And so the survival of the fittest reveals itself. Well, no, uh, but the thing is, is that the, you know, we don't, the apothecarist wasn't really doing anything for us. Apothecary, um, like making medicine is a really good idea in theory, but we weren't able to, it wasn't sustainable. Like we didn't have any of the ingredients I needed ever. Snow irises are like really annoying to get. Oh, we need to be going south. And so I basically never, and here's a, here's the really frustrating thing about apothecary, um, is you can only make medicine in, at an apothecary's table. And so I have to be at the town in order to make medicine. So it's not like, you know, we can't cook the fish whenever we want. Right. Um, and I find that to be such a limiting factor that I basically don't bother with it. I probably should bother with it because it's going to be cheaper than buying medicine. Obviously, that's probably what's sucking up all of our funds. But all the same, it's, you know, it's frustrating. Uh, has offered a reward for any outlaw captured handover prisoner. Uh, Berthlin. We get 65 coin for that. That's not bad. But we did... Oh, we, we do get our chains back? Okay, that's not bad. Let's buy another chain. Weave. Okay, that might be good for making some extra cash. Did someone die? Someone did die. Mimi smashes and Mimi gets her teammates smashed. It's the way of the world. Uh, is that Mimi's way of saying um, the next round's on her? Okay, we need to... Well, we have funds. That's the good news, is we have money. Uh, I'd like to go back and at least try and cure one person. All rounds on me. Drino died. That's okay. Mimi can't... Mimi can't help herself, you know? Um, okay. What is this? Oh, is this... What is this? Oh, is, is this broken armor that I have to repair? Hunter's bow. Oh, this is Drino's bow. Oh, that feels bad. Do we have any new missions? I gotta do this. That's been pending for way too long. Uh, Vetard's squad must be stopped. Let's do this. And I want to ne negotiate higher pay. Let's do 60%. Nice. Um, we'll do 70%. Nice. Uh, accept offer. Cool. Okay, we need to do that. That's some really good money right there. Can anyone confirm, do, do the jobs get harder in this game? What's your favorite traditional roguelike, no cut included? Um, right now, I have to say it's Zorbus. I, I did an extra, um, like, session of Zorbus for, for YouTube. And I really like that game. There, I don't know what it is, it's a couple of things. Um, one, it's like, the fact that it doesn't conform to, like kind of gamey mechanics it has like actual traditional rpg mechanics in it um in it tuesday uh you know it has some like traditional rpg mechanics in it it has like you know infighting it's got some genuinely good tactics which i really enjoy the leveling up and the progression in it is very satisfying um i i really like it i think zorbus is actually on like my high list of of just like excellent traditional roguelikes um, besides that, I mean, I know Tales of Majael is very good, but 
I couldn't get into it. It's way too crunchy for me. Like, I really have to go and look up builds to ensure that I'm, like, building properly. And I don't think that that's very intuitive. I don't think that's very accessible. And I don't really enjoy that. So I, I didn't really... Uh, I, I really didn't, like, uh, enjoy Tales of Magi. Maybe I'll try it again someday, but, you know, sometimes it just doesn't work. Um... What do you mean, prisoner level three? A oh, poisoner. Why am I? Damn. Um. Okay. Sorry. We're we're making some stuff. Is there anything I can craft that I haven't crafted before? Yes, a pitten. Let's make one pitten. Oh, I'm not even close to my next knowledge, like, you know, thing. Uh, I do want to make a lectern. I should probably make a camp chest, but I need more wood. This would just be good for, uh... uh this is for for the thief. It would be good to make, honestly, just... I, I, I want to make the workshop. That's really what I should make. Because then that's a nice chunky bit of knowledge and uh and we we're gonna need the lectern ev eventually you shot me in the back last time i'm sorry i felt sorry for you i don't know if that actually ended up happening though because the thing is is that um that uh that w w that may have been in an alternate universe and that i had to like save and load from i am going to be playing with iron man today the, the agreed upon rule is as long as mimi is still alive we go on i'm gonna i don't want to sell this pitten i do want to buy some rope at some point um i really need to figure out how to sell this stupid fang i'm gonna sell this throwing axe Could have many uses. Well, that's cool. Tell me one use, though. Ayo, save load? No. We're saving because we're... We're committing. I'm sorry. Andrino, uh, how about this? Mimi life is more than... Di I don't know. Like, that's the agreed rule. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh. Don't hate me. <laughs> Listen, uh, if I come across another adventure, I mean, there's one adventure that is, um, like, we've confirmed is going to be Imatan. They are also diseased, unfortunately. <laughs> um, but, uh, Maybe if I come across the next one after that, they could be Andrino the second, unless someone else. I, I don't know. Like, there's, there's a lot of things we could do here. Hmm. You get you get to be Drinoed. I'm sorry that your character drank the Drino. Nevelina's still a fisherman, fisher woman. I'm sorry. I I done messed it up. Okay, let's um, throw some more pork on there. Pay everyone. Rest. We were getting really good XP because everyone was at 15 happiness. We're, we're gaining happiness again. We've gained some more valor. Um... I'm kind of keeping up uh, with the uh, money. Pedro Mountain Mine. Let's uh, check that out real quick. If I could get some iron, that'd be nice. I don't know if these, like, renew themselves at all. Oh, nice. They do. Mimi Crush. I don't know if we also gain some experience with this as well. Ooh, we got a sapphire. Heck yeah, bud. Plus 13 iron ore. That's that's massive. 
There's got to be some more around here somewhere. No? No, I think I got it all. It's fine. Nevelina is so muscly, she can hardly tell her own gender. <laughs> uh, Nevelina uh, <clears throat> identifies as a as a male. I'm gonna I'm gonna say that as a not joke. We'll do that for now. We'll say gender neutral. It doesn't have to be. They don't have to be like trans mask. But you know, they could be a. Uh, in between. Nevelina is so muscly, yeah. Um, oh, we want to sneak up on these guys. Oh god. Okay, go on these. We're gonna we're gonna ambush them. Amy identifies as a hater. That's actually pretty good. Mimi killed. Mimi could doesn't know her own strength, you know. Um, they have leaders protection. We gotta, we gotta kill the leader. Kill the leader. Kill the leader. We're gonna have to, um, yeah, we're gonna have to engage with this Vitard. I don't like this guy's name. <laughs> okay, I don't like his name. I wanna, I, I, he needs a different name. Okay. I want to tell you guys a very quick story. Um, I actually recorded a session of playing Stalker Shadows of Chernobyl. Um, that uh, that recording session is lost to the void. Um, it's it's gone. It'll never be public, basically, uh, for a couple of reasons. But um, one of them being there was a bad word. <laughs> And I read it, and I didn't feel like editing it out, and also was having some technical issues with um, that, with the game, for a number of reasons. And uh, yeah, it was just like not going well. Um, so, <laughs> but that was like the final nail. Was like, I, I there's a bad word in it, in the dialogue, and I read it out loud, and I was like, oh god, what do I do? I'm gonna have to edit that out, and this is already not going well, so never mind. I'm just I'm just not gonna bother. I'm just not gonna bother with it at all, okay? Okay, I'm just never mind. <laughs> Didn't happen. Um So but anyway, I I I wasn't really enjoying that. Like it was an overhaul mod of Stalker. And, uh, I think it was called, um, OGRL or something like that. If you, in case, you know, someone out there cares, um, uh, but I've, I've done away with that. I'm not going to be playing that version of Stalker. Um, instead I'm going to be playing, um, a version of Stalker called, uh, Radiophobia. And I'm already really enjoying it more so. And I think it is, it's actually like, all I want is a functioning version of Stalker Shadows of Chernobyl, okay? <laughs> like, I know that's a lot to ask because the game is ancient and it was all, always kind of buggy. Um, so it's it's a tall order, I know, but um, that's what I want. And so that's what I'm gonna get. We're gonna go over here and I'm gonna, oh, taunt. I, I keep thinking that Granoff has the buff, the buff everyone skill. This game looks fun. War Tales is great. I love War Tales. <clears throat> I'll become the Hammer Lady Mohaha. Okay, let's let's get him out of there. I think uh, Mimi is still gonna hit this guy. Raiders at the end of the turn order. Right, let's do this first. Okay, we, she gets her turn off. And I'm gonna... We can we can have her charge through both these guys. And we get some Valor for that. I love that they updated it so that they, you get Valor now. I really honestly believe that... Um, they... That wasn't a thing before. Okay, I'm gonna taunt this guy. 
And then we're going to do a nice smacky smack. One necromancy book plus Mimesis corpse equals Drino back. I do kind of like this is a very um, there's minor fantasy elements in this game, but I do kind of wish there were a little bit of things like that. Like you could resurrect your old, you know, old companions. Um, this should kill this guy. Dead. I miss I miss Drino. Drino was a good companion. I'm going to spend a bit of Valor just to kill this guy. Actually, we don't need to do that. Um, I don't think Cactus has moved yet. So I'm going to actually, I'm going to move this guy out of the way and towards the combat over here. Yeah, we can, we can, uh, oh, all right, whatever. This is fine. Oh, we need to capture some people. Oh, could I have captured that guy? Dang it. I wonder if I can capture this person. Well, they're they're not even like hurt, so never mind. Nice. 15 crit. I don't think we need to spend more valor on this. Okay, this combat's going pretty well, I will say. Um, this henchman is going to do some stuff. She's probably going to throw an axe at someone. Yeah, Mimi. Oh, Mimi took nine. Oh, and is bleeding. Come on. Oh, my God. Well, I honestly jokes on her because Mimi's about to absolutely stomp on these fools. And I'm going to taunt this guy and do another attack. The reason I'm going to do that is because they're at 15 or below. I should be able to knock that person out now. Just got myself a cup. Pretty refreshing for a tea, not going to lie. I like drinking Mimi tea. Not sure how it translates to English, but it's Hortella. Oh, no. Mimi took some nasty damage there. So we can't, uh, I don't seem to be able to like capture this person. Okay. Let's actually, let's go back here. Who's this person? Okay. We're, we're going to, we're going to try and capture this raider here. So I'm going to knock them. And then I'm going to give him an extra good tap on the noggin. Uh, all right, we're going to try and capture someone else. I don't want to play too many stupid games here. Who's next? Oh, God, it's the henchman. She might actually kill Mimi. Okay, Mimi's okay. I still can't knock this person out, even though they're engaged. I don't understand the, the terms for, like, for that. Demoralize and flee. Do you want to let them go and win the battle? No. I mean, I don't know, maybe. Um, I need to kill this guy in like two blows. I isn't here. Yeah, that's all right. I's got stuff to do. Oh, can we kill them? I didn't manage to capture any of them. I don't understand how to capture people. Sometimes it's uh, it makes sense and sometimes it doesn't. We got another renegades two handed hammer. Let's heal all. We need more raw materials for uh, repairing. 
All right. We are going to head back to Stormcap. We have some really good money coming in. Maybe we can uh, start healing people. I have no idea what Spearmint is. I identify tea by the color of their packaging. I don't know. Is Spearmint a flavor of tea? I know there's mint. Mint is a, like... Um, like, I, I can't remember. I have this, like, um, flavor of tea. It's like starts with an M and it is like mint and it's also green tea. I can never remember the name and I don't want to like try and remember and, get, and say something offensive by accident. Different from peppermint because they are two different leaves, but they are both mint. Someone was telling me that the, I can do trade goods to make some extra cash. I should try and do something like that. So, first of all, let's buy some... Like, I just really want to work on recovering. Oh, we need to we need to get that hand in that quest first. You have anything else? There's just this one. I'm not taking a, a rat quest ever again. Like, the amount of money I've had to sink into curing everyone, the rat quest, I'm in the, I'm in the red. Like, it did not pay for itself in any way. Uh, we're gonna sell that hammer. We're gonna buy some medicine. Look at that, 177, and I'm not even close to curing everyone. Like, what a nightmare. We're gonna cure Cactus, we'll cure Mimi, and we'll cure Porlay. We still have two more people who need medicine. Um, I would like to buy either wood or leather. I think we can buy some leather here. Yeah, okay. So I can buy a little bit of leather. I can also sell some iron ore. I don't really want to do that though. The Oh, we can buy goods here. Maybe I should do that. I'm going to buy a little bit of leather. Um, I'm not sure how much I need. I'm going to see how much is it to make the lectern. Um, lectern. It doesn't actually say. I guess I can check here. Kind of wish I didn't have to pick that every time. Lectern is... Um, okay, I already have enough. So I'm good. So what I'd like to do is actually buy some goods. Um, let's buy some pottery. Oh wait, tricky items to travel due to their propensity to break. Never mind. <clears throat> let's do amber. We can do two amber. And what I'd like to do is kill two birds with one stone here. And uh, <clears throat> we're gonna we're gonna. Um, head to Crocia. I am going to buy some raw materials, though, first. Two of these should be enough. Yes, I know I have no money now. But I need to repair everyone's stuff. We're almost back to, like, you know, where we were before we decided to fight rats um i have three days amount of food that should be enough i just have to go over here to crocia this might be a bad idea i don't know i'm a little bit concerned it's it's going to be a bad idea so what is this all your items are stored in your inventory be sure to always have enough carrying capacity oh you know what we don't have enough carrying capacity we need to sell some stuff which is good actually because maybe um if I could sell some stuff, I won't have uh, encumbrance or money issues. So let's sell the sapphire. Might be a good reason to keep it. Superstitious wealthy wear it to ward off misfortune. We have fresh mint. Not sure if like 
depending on who we sell things to, we get more money. If I go to the market here, this guy, can I sell this carcass? No, no, I can't. I can sell the rat though. I don't really want to sell the rat though. Um, I'm going to sell some iron ore. I don't need this much. Actually, that was dumb. What I should do instead is, um, I'm going to talk to this guy. We're going to buy some leather. And then I'm going to craft some stuff. And then I'm going to sell the stuff I craft. And that'll be a better profit. Uh, we don't have enough wood is the problem. I keep running into wood problems. We can make uh, rags, I suppose. Why do I need... Oh, I guess that makes sense. I need more wood to make this axe. Um, really wish I could figure this out. Uh, I guess I'll make this sword just to get rid of some of this iron. Yo, I clicked on it though. There's a, like a frame hang right at the worst point. Okay, that was not great. That was not great. Um, let's see if that's actually better than what Granoff currently has. Strength 5, Slice. Strength 5, No Slice. Oh, it does have Slice. It just, for some reason, isn't telling me. I wonder, uh, does Cactus need a better... Oh, wow. Cactus could use a better weapon. Um... What about Porlay? Porlay's got this damaged dagger. He could use a better weapon. <laughs> like, he's had this da dagger for a long time. Um, sell this. We're gonna sell this Dublet. Dublet actually might be better than what I'm currently using for someone. Um, I'll sell some of this iron. Iron's easy to come by. Sure, repair gear. Okay, that's actually good, because now we can either sell the doublet for more, but I think someone could probably do with that doublet. Um, armor plus 11, huh? Mimi? Wow, this doublet actually kind of sucks. Okay, the only person it actually improves on is Nevelina. So we'll get rid of these angler's rags. And we'll sell them. And, um... We are... I think we're under capacity now. I'm gonna sell the sandstone. I'm sure there's something I could do with it, but I'm, I'm not... I don't want to figure it out right now. We could sell the hunter's bow. Let's sell the hunter's bow. I know that sucks. We can buy it back later for a ridiculous price, but you know. The box looks very English. How do you guys not know after eight? You mean after eight mints? I like me an after eight mint. I haven't had one in ages. Go to the Stormcrap Tavern to meet with a mysterious stranger. You? My name is Albereth. I am the eldest son of a family seeking to join the Broker Council. But for a merchant to obtain the coveted Broker title, they must prove their supply lines are efficient and their business partners reliable. Unfortunately, I am lacking the latter. I believe mercenaries such as you, who know the value of both shiny crowns and sharp swords, can be of help. I need you to convince Tiltron and Marheim shopkeepers to become my loyal resellers. You will speak with them, possibly negotiate or even bribe them, so that they agree to sell the wares I provide. Blueprint reinforced layer of the fox. Sure. Meet me here once you've finished. Um, so what do I have to do? Where are, where are my missions even? Okay. Um, hammer for hire, the broker's tail. 
Um, the broker's tale. Follow mission instructions to complete this objective. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. How do I do that? Who, who do I need to talk to to get this done? Um... Maximum Valor points increased by one. I don't know how to complete this mission, I won't lie. I, I know I'm supposed to talk to some shopkeepers. Maybe I'll just talk to all the shopkeepers. Probably we'll start, start with the blacksmith. Nope. We'll, we'll go with the market then. You touch it, you buy it. Those refugees, I understand there's a war in Adoran, but that doesn't mean they can just help themselves. Oh, approach. Talk about broker Alberas offer with the merchant. You mean the Gossenberger Burger Alderberth? Alderberth, yes, he did approach me, but I only sell the wares I pro of producers I know. I have no reason to trade with a foreigner. Uh, we're going to threaten them only because I can stand to gain a bit of, uh, like this, this goes down over time. And as long as it's not one, then I'm okay. There's no need for that. After all, who wouldn't want to deal with such a respectable businessman? I agree to buy his wares and to sell them here in his name. However, I require proof that he can hold up his end of the bargain. I believe the exquisite Marheim commodity everyone's talking about will do the trick. Um, didn't I need to talk to someone else as well? I'll try the apothecarist. Nope. Sad thing that I'm broke this month. My GF bought her friend a wash machine on her, our, on her credit card. I hate borrowing money. Why did, what? All right. That's an odd thing to do. Maybe. You have your work cut out for you. There's no lack of honest folk in need of help to fend off the refugee menace. Okay. Um, follow mission instructions. Go to the Marheim Tavern to meet with the Brotherhood. The Broker's Tale. Well, where are the, where are the mission instructions? The, like, that is like 100% not clear. Um, world map, paths, like there's nowhere, I don't like have a log or journal as I, as far as I know. Options, shortcuts, world map, compendium, pause, basic attack, rotate camp elements. Um, I like this game, but sometimes it's, it's not clear what I'm supposed to do. I, and I certainly don't like it when I hover over a quest to find out more. It tells me, follow the instructions. Like, okay, thanks for that, I guess. Meet with the Brotherhood. Bring required goods to the merchant. I have to go to Marheim, I think. I haven't been to Marheim. I also thought, shaking my head, standing for something. SMH is shaking my head. I I never remember what F A A F A F A I K. I never I never remember what that stands for ever. I'm gonna follow this road. Um, I might have to go. We can go north a little bit. See what happens. As far as I know. Yeah. Okay. I, I never remember that. I'll forget again. I promise. Oh, is there like a gorge there? Okay, we're going to make camp. A little bit concerned here uh, that we're making camp in the woods. Also kind of concerned about our money situation or um, food situation.
Danger level average, 10%. Okay, I mean, that's not bad. You've gained four valor. That is that is good. The world is much bigger than I anticipated. It feels like I could spend my life traveling and still never visit the same place twice. Um, three happiness would be great. Celebrate. And I, Mimi did say that the next round was on her, so... What do you mean endure it? Get a negative two valor. Why would I... Why would I do this? Daydream, get two valor. What do you think, Mimi? I, I'm pretty sure I know which one you're going to go for, but what do you think? All rounds. Celebrate. This is great because we're going to get some uh, bonus experience. All right. Um, so I, need, I think I need to go east. I'm hoping um, like I, I don't really have the funds to pay my crew just yet. We're also missing a member. Yeah, yeah, there it is. You got to pay that pay them wages. Uh, if I can catch up with one of these merchants, I might be able to uh, scrounge up some cash. You guys have raw materials and alizarian powder. Will you buy my perch? I shouldn't sell food. That's the only thing I really should not sell. We're going to sell um, my marsh parsley and some fresh herb to make up the uh, cash. There's a crossing. What does this say? Can I? No, there's nothing there. Uh, North Vetrus Province. Uh, Gossenberg Border Crossing. Okay. I thought I saw something there. I've never been this far. I take one step further. I've been farther than you know the line. What's this guy? I don't have enough money to cross the border. I don't know where to go from here. Oh yeah, how much does it cost to cross the border? I didn't anticipate this. You need an official pass to enter Gothenburg unless you're willing to pay up to you. 200? Jesus. Well, that's not happening. I need way more money. I need a pass, I guess. Well, there's a quest nearby. No, sort of. Sorry, there. I thought there was a quest nearby, but that's a. This is a quest that I have to go like all the way around the mountain. Um, so this was a waste of time, kind of. Is this fog? Is this that blasted fog that I hate so much? Okay, that's the fog. I recognize that fog. Should be able to sneak by it. Oh god, I'm just like really struggling to keep up with my needs. Let's go south and try and do this other refugee mission. Oh, yeah, you guys will like constantly ask me to... We're just gonna leave you alone. Let's check out these salt mines. We can probably get some nice iron. I know that doesn't make sense. But, uh... You know, it does if you don't think about it too hard. Listen, a mine is a mine is a mine. You might find what's yours, but eventually it will become mine. Um, I know I messed that up. This has salt in it. I don't want salt. I want the iron. There's not really any other iron in here. 
me me be drinking that tea. Some mercenaries over there. I really don't want to have to do any more combat right now. I'm like barely keeping up. I would honestly really just like to get to a point where um, I can... Uh... Oh yeah, I forgot about that, dude. Is that the mission down here? A refugee leader awaits you in the Haven. I don't think that's the mission. Um, where everyone's cured and I don't have to, like, you know, worry about money. <laughs> Like, I'm constantly worrying about money. What happened to the trade goods? I didn't pay attention. The trade goods didn't pay out because I can't get to the next zone. I have to find a zone I can get to where I can sell the goods. Fergus, refugee leader, talk to. Uh, mercenary, mercenaries, just in the nick of time. Welcome to the Haven. My name is Fergus. I am the former Lord Mayor of Corsia, and I now lead the refugees. As you've discovered, the locals aren't exactly welcomed. Uh, hasn't haven't exactly welcome, welcomed us with open arms. I have therefore decided to move our people to this cold and isolated wasteland. But it seems that it is still not far enough for the Lady Mayoress of Stormcrap. Stormcap. <laughs> Sorry. Stromcap. Take our woodcutter camp, for example. We need wood to fortify our new home and survive the winter months. But the local farms have been harassing us ceaselessly. I fear the worst, that we haven't heard from our woodcutters in several days. Hence the reason for your presence here. The situation could be far too dangerous for the humble farmers we are. I need mercenaries to find out what happened to our men. Oh, I get a bunch of wood for this, and that's actually exactly what I need. Woodcutters are just north of here. I'm going to do a save. Um, anyone, anything else going on here? I know that Fergus and the others are doing their best, but let's face it, we don't won't survive the winter months if we stay here. We sell all our surplus to help with the cost of rebuilding this ruin. Your prices are the same, though. You, you guys are not exactly competitive. I can sell the amber for a slight profit. <laughs> uh, I bought it for, for 50 and I can sell it for 55 Sure. I actually do benefit from that a little bit. I'm pretty sure this medicine is a good price. I'll buy uh, some medicine. Fish oil. Strom cap equals storm crap. <laughs> Indeed. Is there anything else here? Usually there's some, like, secrets. Oh, well, who's this guy? I asked Beth or Berthram to bring me everything I need to sew, sew warmer clothing. When do you think he will be back? I have to imagine there's some secrets here. What about you? What do you got going on? We're trying to rebuild a village from scrap. We've got more than enough farmers, but we are in dire need of skilled craftspeople. If you find a blacksmith amongst the refugees, please bring them to us. We are in such a bind that we are willing to pay for your help. I mean, I'd, I'd hope so, you know? Okay, there doesn't seem to be extra any extra people. I think if I... I can't camp here? That's weird. But we're going to go north. Uh, I'm going to see if I can accomplish this goal. Um, we'll just, uh, pay. I am running out of food. I'm a little bit worried about that. I don't need to, like, completely fulfill our food, but we would lose uh, morale if I, if I shortchanged that. There's some iron. Free iron. Pretty sure those are the refugees over there. Okay. Deserters. Um, use your crown and influence to convince this group to let you go. Is this where I need to be? Not really. Uh, they've got a bomber, which means we're going to be set on fire. Uh, 
Can't save. Hey, Demothorn, how you doing? I'm going to negotiate for now. There's a... Oh, I see. Altus Tower. I'm going to try and find my... Woodcutter's Camp. Okay, here we go. All right, so what's what's the deal here? The chief is worried about us, and so he should be. The locals are getting more vindictive by the minute. They harass us, and we haven't enough men to send a message in. What? Watch out, the farmers are back. What do you mean, the farmers? You there, mercenaries, since the chief sent you, hurry up and join our lads outside the camp and stop these fools from getting in. What? What? I don't know who I'm fighting for here. What do you want now? Don't you have anything better to do than harass uh, refugees? Even if you were Ador himself, you couldn't cut down those trees. What do you mean? That's it. If you... Uh, if you... What? What's it to you if we cut those trees instead of, uh, of any others? The Mount Altus Forest is sacred. It has belonged to the tools since the dawn of time. If you upset the little folk, they will attack all the surrounding settlements, including ours and your haven. Don't be absurd. The tools aren't even real. They're just fairy tales. We won't freeze to death over some imaginary pixies. How dare you, for the eye's sake. Go and tell your hallucinations to move out. There's no lack of trees in this country. Mercenaries, do you hear that? Name your price and give those blasphemers the pu punishment they deserve. The tools will be most grateful. So we get to pick who we're fighting. Now, this is one of those situations I kind of wish I had a bit more information. Like, who, who, okay, tool defenders. I'm pretty sure these are the refugees. No, these are the refugees. Um, so I'm pretty sure I want to, like, I, I don't know. Get 20 wood. That's what I was promised. Or beans. They're going to pay me in beans. Are they magic beans? I need that wood. Um, so they get two allies? If I fight them? Hoodlums are refugees? I I mean, like... I, I don't get it either, really. It's, it's a little bit confusing. So this is Anthus. I think Anthus is our friend, uh, indicated by that green bar there. Porle, you are in a bad spot. And Cactus, you are also in a bad spot. Um, let's get someone. Okay, we need some, a few people over here. We need some people over there. Cactus and Porle make for good friends. Um... These guys have a bonus. Movement doubled. Deals 6 to 8 damage to the target and applies destabilization for one round if they are already engaged with an ally. So I'm going to engage with this guy right away. Uh, I think that that would be a good idea. We're going to... Oh, we, we actually have Max Valor. I, have, I don't think I've ever seen that. I do have encouragement. So I'm going to engage this guy as close to my allies as I can and then do an encouragement. Oh, that's not a great encouragement. But we're going to do it anyway cuz I need to I'm going to burn some valor so that I can gain some temporary valor. Yikes forever. Oh man. Really? Okay, we're going to go over here and uh I'll get some extra valor for this. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use, um, again, I, I want to burn some Valor to use some Valor. We're going to use a Poison Bomb. Those uh, those frame hangups are, are yikes forever. And we're going to kill this guy. Oh. Um, do I want to kill him? Yeah, let's kill him. I know the Valor, but it's better to kill them so that we don't, you know, don't push our luck, you know? This guy is not engaged. Um, 
So we need to marry him. Haha. Uh -huh. I had forgotten that meme. Yikes forever. I like yikes forever. Um, the problem with Mimesis is that she needs like a whole round to set up an attack. I wonder if we could potentially... If she did like this... Oh, never mind. She's not going to reach them. So never mind. Um, let's taunt this guy. Actually, let's not taunt this guy. Let's just, let's just do a normal attack. And hope that it goes off, you know? We're defending Anthas. Oh, this is the captain. The cap. Oh no, he's got one of those stupid. No, never mind. He's okay. I mean, he's a ranger. Oh my god, where is he going? Where the heck is he going? Yo, Granoff, it's time to uh, live to your namesake. That would have been really funny if I had actually planned to go and chase that guy off. I'm a little bit worried. Like, what's, what is this guy's, like, move? We're going to give him a good old kick. Actually, instead of a kick, I'm going to use deflection. I'm trying to play a bit more conservatively. I, I've, I'm a little worried that I am... Developing some bad habits. Okay. They're surrounded. This guy should die in no time. Nevelina. You've got a good target right here. Uh, we'll weaken them. I, I need to protect this guy, so... I need to make sure that he doesn't take too much damage. Okay, um, poor Lay. Let's use you first. We're going to surround this guy. I might be able to kill him right now. Actually, no, which is fine because then we gain that Valor back. So what is this guy's plan? What? What are you doing? <laughs> what? Oh, no. Okay. What? He just killed his own dude. And then he runs away again. Like, what? Dude, I, like, I'm honestly totally cool with that, but damn. We might be able to get a cool kill here. Nope. It's okay. Oh, yeah, we can kill him. Cool. This is going well so far. Oh, no! Uh, I should have used Mimi as soon as possible. Shoot. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to move here. And then Relentless Charge through both of them. Pop, pop. And then back up a bit. I'll set up an attack just on the off chance that they actually move up to her, like, you know, but. Okay, we're going to have. This guy, this guy's going to be really annoying, isn't he? Okay, we're going to run uh, Granoff over there and we're going to use protection. <laughs> no. Oh my god! You'll be defeated if they die. What the heck? Do you want to retreat immediately? Not really. And the only person that had the stupid um, recovery move was Drino, and they're dead. So I guess I just lose. That's really annoying. I, I guess I... Because the thing is, retreating... Yeah, like, now I, I lose like big time right everyone loses uh i'm getting kind of frustrated with this game every time i think that uh, like you know it's going well then I, I get you know i just like eat garbage 
And now this is going to be like completely redone, right? I may as well load. Like the thing about this now is this is exactly the same as it was before. Nothing changed about it. And it won't let me, it won't let me escape this. Like I want to load at this point because there's no point in doing this combat again, except now with a disadvantage. Companion six. How long ago was this? When did I last save? I thought I saved quite recently, but I'm starting to wonder now. And uh, and it just over okay. This game needs some serious you like interface updates. I'm not kidding. It's it's seriously a problem. Like save. I was prompted to create a new file name before. Except now when I click on it, it doesn't do that right. So now I've just overwritten my save, which means I'm now stuck in this horrible situation, where I have less valor and all of these people are at full health. That's seriously a problem. Like that's 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 enough to alienate me from this game. I'm not even kidding. It's that that's like not okay. If you're going to make it so you have this like lose condition and you the only option is to retreat from the battle, at least make it so that there's a reason to come back to that fight. Like you you lose so much I thought what, why are we here? So the settlement, the refugee settlement did not count. Oh my God. I'm running into some serious frustrations with this game right now. Oh, and I have the Amber again. Um, Man, this is kind of how it ended last session, too. Where I just, like, uh, kind of didn't want to continue. Because uh, I, I loaded a, a fairly old save. I don't think this is as bad as it was last time. But it's not great. Uh, I'm pretty sure we lost Mimisi's cool, uh, roleplay segment. Yo, I'm sorry, guys. I'm, uh, it, I'm having a rough time with this game lately. Permadeath goes burr. Guess you'll have to load it. The, the problem with loading a save is, I, I think, the, what do you mean Bill has a roleplay session? The, the problem with loading a save is that... The my last save, the auto save is not frequent in this game, and I don't know how long ago our last save is. Uh, hence my problems with the interface. Like, I don't know how long ago our save is, and so I saved in order to try and like try and figure out how long ago our save is. Except instead of creating a new save, it just overwrote my only save. So now I am stuck in this situation. I have no idea where I am even anymore. Drino's death seems to have rattled Bill. Ask the group for hugs. Or, uh, oh, we need cabbage. Stay and watch. Make sure that no one else suffers the same fate. Bill will gain the guard duty trait. Chance of a nearby prisoner escaping are reduced by 1%. Do we want hugs or guard duty? I'm gone for two minutes and this is what I come back to. No man's sky also. Yeah, a save system UI needs a bit of like I, I, I want to I want better a better slightly better interface. Hugs. We got one vote for hugs. What happened? I was making tea. What happens you know what's happening, guys, is like every single combat I'm in, I'm in like an untenable situation where like either someone dies or in the last case where I was actually winning. There's a lose condition that basically means I have to retreat. Um, when you have to retreat, you all of your armor gets inexplicably damaged. 
Um, everyone needs to be healed. So then I ha that wears on my, my money, my resources, my funds. So I may as well just load because I don't want to be in this tedious situation where I'm constantly having to recover my funds and my resources and my food and all of this stuff. And I'm constantly having to, to recover my money. Um, so that just sucks, right? But I couldn't load because I didn't know how long ago my load was. So I saved in order to s try and inspect my old load. But instead of making a new save, it saved over my old save. And so now I'm stuck in the situation where I, I, I don't know where I am even. Like that's, that's, that's a very good example of a horrible situation created out of a bad interface. So... I'm sorry I'm like complaining and I'm I'm kind of ruining the vibe here a little bit but like I'm just trying to talk out to talk through like what is really frustrating me right now. Hugs forever. Okay, we got we got two votes for hugs. Nevelina's relationship is improved with Bill. I mean that's that's positive. And so um you know this what used to be an Iron Man game has now become into uh I need to save every second every second <laughs> uh because i don't want to have to constantly play catch up we lost reno and i mean that sucks um but like what you know um not every situation can be even as salvage salvageable as like we lost a member honestly losing a member we got two rubies that time Losing a party member was less traumatic than like having to recover all of our armor and healing everyone because we are just like always playing catch up with our money. And um, I will say that that is getting kind of tedious. I almost OD on my sleeping pills just to fix for what? We, 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 we got some hugs though, so it's all good. Um, on sleeping pills, do you like mint tea? There's interesting things happening in chat right now. So uh, I'm going to say this right now. Iron Man is done because I don't want to play catch up anymore. I, maybe if someone dies and I don't have to recover everyone else, I'll, uh, I'm, I'm good with that situation, but I, I'm no longer going to do this whole, like, every story is valid thing because a lot of these stories are not valid they're just boring <laughs> i hate to be a downer about it but it's true so we're gonna buy a, a rope i'm gonna sell some comfrey to try and make up some money we do have a ton of comfrey i can sell a ton of comfrey oh this is before i sold uh, i made that sword no, actually, we did make that sword because I don't seem to have the wood. And I can sell this amber. I gained a little bit of uh, experience towards an achievement there. Okay, camp. Mint tea bros forever. Mint tea is good. I like mint tea. Um, I was going to say, I was going to say, uh, the reason I, I'm a tan, maybe you can tell me about this. I was playing, uh, OGSR. I can't remember the exact, like, wording of it, but it was a overhaul mod for Stalker. And, um, I actually did a, a recording session. I was talking about this earlier and, uh, it, you know, it, it didn't go well for various reasons. The thing that actually killed it was they told me to like get in a car um to to for a mission like i was i was gonna i had to load up a car and um drive it somewhere with a a, a trunk full of artifacts um you know cool stuff can you guys stop chasing me please uh so like that was the situation I was in. Like I had to I had to load up a car, right? That's the point. And uh, when I went to interact with the car, the in all of the interface was in Russian, and I just straight up didn't know what I was supposed to do at all. 
Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna save here. That's what's happening right now. Like that's that's what's going on. So yeah, I just like quit. Like that was uh, that was that that is actually what killed the the, the that version of Stalker, and then that's why I downloaded um, Radiophobia. And so far, it seems to be a bit more stable, and it seems to be a bit more functional. Just giving context, because I just woke up and I hate my broken sleep so much, I might almost OD on them. Oh, I see. Don't OD on sleeping pills. Yeah, that, that would be bad. Don't drink too much either. I'm also giving context to, um, you know, my bizarre situation. Uh, so this guy's gonna give double movement speed, which sucks. So I gotta... This foot soldier is going to move first, so let's go ahead and engage them. Let's engage them with, I think, Granoff. Yeah, Granoff gains extra bonus. I wonder, if I go here, and if I use Destabilizing Strike, will that give me... Valor? Yes. Nice. I just crit twice. I don't know what mod you were talking about. Uh, yeah, don't worry about it. It is an overhaul mod for... Wow. Nevelina needs better armor. We need to get more armor for Nevelina. It's, it's like seriously not okay. Um, I'm pretty sure if I go over here and I engage Gundid, um, I may still get the Valor because I'm still next to someone I'm not in combat with. And that's the important thing. Also, Phalanx, Phalanx, if I do this... No, never mind. That's silly. I should be able to throw up. I should have throw, thrown the potion vial first. That would have been really smart, but I didn't because I'm apparently not good at video games. So Nevelina is now engaged in combat. That's really bad because I was going to run her back out of there. I'm going to have to now disengage and take an extra attack. And it's always the full attack. I, I feel like there needs to be more stuff in this game that favors the player because right now it feels really punishing. Um, I don't want to lose Nevelina. I really don't want to lose Nevelina. Like, it's it's just like everything is going badly right now. Let's see if we can't kill this guy right now. Gun did. Actually, what we'll do is we'll use Wrath. That'll kill Gun did. And then I'm going to engage this Phalanx with a Weakening Blow. Wow, that'll actually destroy their armor. 26 damage. That was really good. Go top. You can't be surrounded there. You are next on the list, I think. Am I in the game or did I get Time Paradoxed? You are going to be in the game again. But yeah, you did get Time Paradoxed, unfortunately. Temporarily. Uh, let's do this. And I'm going to then do this. Let's see what this guy does. Oh, yeah. Engaging with them would actually be amazing. Uh, except they didn't engage with them. They did like an extra attack, but not a proper attack okay let's uh actually engaging with cactus will be good because we'll get some extra valor except we didn't get the valor because we killed him that's actually pretty good uh let's do an encouragement crackers with dosa do dosa la something dosa those, is it Dochi? Doch? Do, do, Doch? Duchi? 
Deutsche Deutsch. Single thing I love about France is those sweet and salty crackers. I don't know what they're called. Dav to Dave Dav to Lati La Lati. Who's next in the combat? Foot soldier will take a turn. Which one is foot soldier? I didn't mean to do that. Return. I didn't mean to do that. And there's no undo in this game. Oh my God. I'm really having a hard time with this interface today. Like I could have killed this guy and instead I like I do this dumb, dumbass thing over here. God damn it. My God. It's just like seriously a problem. Um, all right, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to kill this guy with wrath. And then I'm going to back Nevelina up because Nevelina is hurt right now. <sighs> Man, need to watch some Brazilian combat content. His Portuguese is funny. MC's attack is going to hit no one. But she is going to get a cool charge. And if she goes over here, she might let's let's taunt this guy. And now both of these guys are engaged and um we'll actually get a double attack with Mimi for once. Now you dude, you cost me the combat last round. You better smarten up. Okay. Um yeah, they can Well, that's fine. Honestly, yeah, hit this guy. He's got a full bar of health. Granoff can get us some extra valor. Nice. In fact, can, he, can we kill this guy right now? Yo. You watching Vinland Saga? Yo, I love Vinland Saga. That's one of like, like, honestly, one of my favorite animes ever. I watched a You Suck at Cooking video about it. It apparently is mostly made of cheese. Onion soup? Yeah, onion soup is the bomb. The bomb diggity, y'all. So I could kill this guy. Oh, we could ca uh, only use one base action. Let's try and capture some, some fools. Oh, uh, Mimesis is going to kill everyone. We're like, Mimesis, we could have made prisoners out of some of those people. And she's like, sorry. Sorry, guys. Mimesis, we're running into actual money problems. Come on. Get get with the program. Every time an attack hits several enemies, you gain. And the problem is that she, Nevelina doesn't have any attacks to do, do that, so we're just going to take this again. Um, let's go with extra strength. Tylenol. I've never watched Vinland Saga, but I read it. I read a little bit of it, and the, the anime starts very differently. Like, it, it, it very much reorganized everything. Okay, now we have to go back to the refugee camp. Might as well grab this snow iris. Oh, almost got a little spot of bother there. Mm 
Let me see Mimi Bonks. Thank you for helping our woodcutters. I do not know if their work will be enough to see us through until spring, but at least you have given us hope. Uh, that's cool. Where's my wood? Guy? Where's my wood, though? What is this? Legendary presence. Follow mission instructions. This game is really just not doing the good stuff today. <laughs> like, follow instructions. What instructions? Where? Tell me. All I want is some information. Please. Y'all just being so vague about everything. I go back to the woodcutters. There we go. All this t talk of tools was driving me mad. It was high time someone talked some sense into them. Here is your reward. We'll be sure to let the chief know we are, we're safe now that you've cleared the way. Thank you. That's all I wanted. We're very close to actually seeing the career of this game. <laughs> Can we take some wood? I, I honestly would love to take some more wood. Can we steal this wood? No. All right. Bimple. No serotonin today. Now I want to see Bimple play Morrowind. Why do you want pain for me? Why do you wish pain on me? What have I done? Outside of provide very mediocre content. Countless hours of mediocre content. We're saving. Okay, there's actually positive here. I, I don't mean to be so negative today. There was actually some positivity here. We, we completed a combat without death. And I might actually complete something else over here. What is that? Are those good guys? Hard to tell. Let's talk to them. We need to make camp. We were sent from Alazar to rid the northern forest of its plague rat infested. Yo, you've got cure! You've got cure! Um, yeah, we'll buy that. We'll buy two of those. Actually, I'm gonna buy three of them because, um, once we get Imatan, he's gonna be plagued again. Um, what can we sell? Let's sell some comfrey. And some fresh mint. Perfect. However, we're also looking for an infected man. Apparently Strom Cap cast him out. Yo, is it? Are you guys looking for Imatan? I think they're looking for Imatan. Don't I have a quest over here? Yeah, don't I have to go up this tower or something? Hey, self-deprecation is forbidden here. We're a pro-serotonin community. I only provide the best of content all of the time. My content is, is a top tier. A amazing. It, it, it will it will it pay the bills, you know. Please untie me. Layhart goons could be here any minute. They want to take me back to Adoran. I am no danger to anyone. They are after me because I deserted. I need a lockpick for this. <laughs> Can't imagine what they do to artisans like me. Uh, I might be able to make. Uh, I can't can't make camp here. Again, running into interface problems. We should be able to make a uh, lockpick. Yeah. Honestly, I should just make a bunch of these. We actually have an extra knowledge point. We should learn how to make perch soup. Um, oh, we can make the lectern, finally. 
Yes. I didn't mean to leave that. I want to I want to see the lectern. There we go. We don't have a study. We don't have a scholar, but um, you know, we have a lectern. Have you guys eat sequios? It's pretty good with coffee or tea. Gonna try that one of these days. Sounds really good. I I don't know what it is. Uh, bonus carrying capacity increased by five. Wages paid to companions reduced by ten. Might be worth it actually. Maximum valor points increased by one. Increases by one the number of contracts displayed on the list. Honestly, this could be really nice. I'm considering cannibalism. Not even kidding. I'm a 10. Do you have a recommendation for, uh, for one of these? I know Endurance Run, but when my, oh, light pony plate. We could make some pony plate for Bill. Uh, I wouldn't mind learning how to make a dagger. Um, Brigadine. I honestly like learning how to make armor might be a really good idea because I've been I've been taking some nasty damage, so I might wait a little bit on that actually. Uh, but the good news is we can finally uh, treat our all of our injuries, which is it, this has been long time coming. We're actually kind of in the black. I mean, I don't have any money. I'm completely broke, but, you know. Um, we are kind of running out of food, though. Uh, we're going to have wages to pay today. With wheat, it would be quite different, I guess. Can I replace the cornstarch with just wheat flour? We don't really do corn products here. We don't do corn, okay? Um, okay, let's talk to this guy again. We should be able to help him. wonder if he could become our, uh... Our, our companion. Release. Select the thief. Oh god, really? All right, Nevelina is going to be a, a thief now, which I'm pretty sure she was to begin with. You're a thief now. It's fine. We could probably use a thief. I like how all, all of this thing, stuff is going down, and meanwhile, Chad is like, you should try this recipe. Yeah, can you replace the flour with cornstarch? No, we don't really do. We don't do corn here. Okay, well, can I sub out the corn for something? Rotate the pick and press left to insert. We got lock picking mechanics. Is this new? Oh god, I should have made more lock picks. All right, we are gonna make some more lock picks. I need to make a bunch more lock picks. Let's, uh, I, I, I anticipate 10 failures here. I watched Whiplash with my GF this week. Great movie, damn. It's basically the Skyrim uh, lock picking mechanic. Thank you. I'll work for anyone except Count Lehart. I'm an excellent craftsman, you know. I can do wonders. Take me with you. Um, and lead me to my future boss. I may not have the gold to pay you, but times like these, I imagine he'll pay handsomely for a man of my talent. I wonder if this is the blacksmithing guy we need. Now following our troop. 
They are an apprentice, a blacksmith. That's a dang shame, honestly. They have no equipment. Um, I would have thought that they would be, uh, at least in like a, um, like a blacksmith we could hand in to that one quest, but they're not. So interesting. I uh, wonder if we can use a pitten to get down from this mountain as a shortcut. Actually, can we get down this way? Is this a shortcut that I never noticed? Uh, it kind of is, actually. Well, that's silly. I never noticed that way up there. Hammer for hire, the broker's tail. I'm, I'm thinking um, maybe we can hand in that the blacksmith to that guy. I'm hoping that's the case. Some baddies over. Oh, God. Wait, is that? No, it's not like a full on combat going on. I was wondering if I could, like, jump in and take sides. Is there any other biomes besides forest and snow? There's a ton of game that I have not seen yet because I've been, like, stuck in, uh, like, wage purgatory. Excuse me, what? What? Who are you and why are you chasing me? Oh, I see they're chasing me because I have this uh, blacksmith on me, maybe? Can I hand him in to this guy? Hand over. Yes! Actually, something positive. Can't believe it. I use for you... I ask you for a blacksmith and you bring me a refugee on the run from an Adoranian count. Oh, very well then, but we'll, he'll have to work out back. And don't you go telling anyone he's here. Okay. Hey, we actually have enough to look um, continue the story. Keep your mouth shut. We just got a ton of raw materials. Really good stuff. Really positive stuff happening right now. Um, what I'd like to do is I want to learn how to make armor. Um, axe, a different sword? It looks like the same sword. Like this is the same thing I learned. This, but again? What, I don't, I don't get this. Forge, forge blueprints. Blacksmith experience required. I don't get it. Um, I'm going to learn how to make armor. It isn't filled with shrooms all the way. It's like a small soup that call Rasolnio. Rasolnio? Okay, let's uh, let's make some armor. Reinforced plate armor, padded brigadine. This is very expensive. Craft wants to reveal the superior set in the compendium. This is reduced armor, but it's plate. Oh, it only takes iron ore. So we could actually make one of these. Ah, messed it up. Okay, that's not bad. I'll take that for sure. And we should be able to make the other set as well. Yes. Perfect set. Padded Brigadine. We got some good knowledge for that. Uh, and then there's also the doublet, which is going to require some more leather, which I anticipated that I wasn't going to be able to make a full set of everything. Um, who needs, I feel like Nevelina needs better armor. 
whatever armor they're using is bad. Oh, the duplet. <laughs> it's the only thing I didn't make. Oh, wait. We made... She, she can wear plate armor. Okay, so that's good. That's, like, very much better armor than what she was using. Uh, Deserter's Brigadine. So we did make a Brigadine for... So Cactus actually has some, like, decent armor now. We need to make him a better shield also. Like, dang. Um, so those are the only... That's the only armor I managed to make. Uh, Deserter's Brigadine, can we... No, that, that's the same. I wonder if we can trade up anyone. Rags? Uh, yeah. Oh, can't equip medium armor. Okay, never mind. This would offer Porlay more better movement. So I guess that's better. Angler's Rags. Okay, Deserter's Brigadine is going to be much better for Granoff. So everyone gets a, an upgrade. Slight upgrade anyway. Good stuff. Really good stuff. Um, we got to take a quest because I'm running out of money again. I'm going to save. Uh, let's let's just te check for quests before I save. Parlay is almost level 4. Nice. Review. Yo, we have the perfect amount of influence right now. Um, b -b 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 hard no. Marheim is desperate for looking, desperately looking for three of pottery and is ready to pay the price. Well, that's not the, the, the pottery is like extremely valuable though. It says easy, but I don't think this is easy. Um, let's negotiate a higher price. Negotiate. Negotiate. Accept offer. I need that money. How do we get to Marheim? Meet with the Brotherhood. Sell three pottery in Marheim. I guess, uh, I guess I just have to sell the pottery. The bad news is I, I can't afford three pottery. <laughs> Good Lord. I, I just keep running into these problems. Um, definitely not doing rat infestation. Maybe I want to take on that bandit's lair. It might be easier now. Um, I need more iron. When I was a kid, I would throw a knife into the air and grab its handle. Very dumb, but what's even more dumb is that I just chopped some veggies and for some reason I decided to give it a try again. Now my hand is bleeding. It hurts to hold a pen, which is important in math. All my veggies are bloody now, and if I eat them, I may be a cannibal. Leader awaits you in Haven. He has something important to tell you. Well, uh, I mean, that's cool and all, but I, I need money. I need to get a pass. Will the mayor give me a pass yet? Okay, she's not here. You know what? Um, we're going to leave it there. It's been uh, two and a half hours, so we can uh, start Weird West. Things are, are, are kind of turning around, but I don't know. They're still tentative. Um, but also, I'm going to hit the can. I mean, save. Yeah, we're fine. I, I'm still enjoying this game all in all. I ran into a lot of interface problems today, for sure. But, uh, you know, it's it's still going well for the most part. Got off there very lucky, could have cut a tendon. 